Yo, 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 what's up guys, it's King Mimikyu, and welcome back to more Tokyo Extreme Razor Zero. In the last episode, we defeated not one, not two, but three bosses, members of the Zodiac, which is No Crown King, Crying Pluto, and Red, and Red Devil. In today's episode, we're going to finish the rest of the Zodiac and the last team. Mmm. That is good Coke. I mean, not Coke, uh, Pepsi. But also, here's the question of today. What was your guys' favorite episode? And what is your guys' favorite car that we used? Now, the cars that I used in this entire playthrough was, uh, I'll give you, I'll give you, uh, each both. Number one, number two, or number three. Let me know in the comments. Number one, two, or three. And then, uh, yeah. That'll be your boat. So I guess we'll go ahead and start. No, it looks good. But we'll go ahead and start. Number one, two, or three. I like number three because of its speed. Number two did do pretty good, but, um, I felt like it needed to do a little bit better. Like, I wish number two did a little bit more in the post game. I mean, in the second half of this game. Like, it was struggling with, uh, another star. Like, you know how it was struggling with all those Subarus? Like, I was, I wish it didn't struggle that much. We got fast beat from the, uh, Speed Masters. I wish the other two teams that appeared along with the Speed Masters were in this game. I forgot their names, but I know one of them, like, like, one, there was, like, two guys that drive white cars, two guys that drive black two guys that drove red you know I wish that that team was in, in here and then team infinity you know and the leader would still be marvelous or marvelous manner how you would like to say it well, you're almost done with this game you guys just three four five six seven eight more races to do and then we're done and we just have the Wanders, but the Wanders you can always do off screen or whatever. So that's always fine. We got like, I got a few Wanders that I'd like to take care of on screen though. We got White Witch. Which is driving an RX-7. Our last RX-7 we'll be seeing in this game. At least I think we'll be seeing our last RX-7. Hopefully we don't screw up. Uh, nope. Yep. Nope. <laughs> yep. Nope. Nope. Yep. That stinking wall. And he's done. Uh, this playthrough is going to get hyped. Or not hyped. It's going to end correctly. Um, yeah, I'm going to miss playing this game. Like, there's so much memories in this game. So much memories. Like, we faced so many bosses and we beat them easily. But you know, it, it's the same with Tokyo Extreme Racer 3. You know, there's so many memories in that game. Like, we faced so many amazing rivals. We basically only used one car for the rest of the game, which was our Subaru. Our Subaru Impreza. But you know, the rivals in that game were easier, which were the which were beatable at the end of the game. We got Maniac Player, the last Subaru legacy in this game. Yeah, there's not many that sub not many Subarus in this game. I think there was more Subarus in uh Tokyo Extreme Racer 3. Cause we had like a team full of Subarus in uh Nagoya. A team full of Subarus in Tokyo. And that... No, we had two teams full of Subarus in Tokyo. One in Nagoya. So we had more Subarus in in uh, Tokyo Extreme Racer 3 than we did with this game. So... They put way more Subarus in Tokyo Extreme Racer 3 than they did with this game. But, you know, they put a, a lot of different cars in this game. That's why I like this game a little bit more. 
is because they added more cars. In Tokyo Extreme Racer 3, they added more rivals but less cars. I wish they had more cars as well as rivals. And I wish in this game they added more car more rivals as well as cars. Like make like Nagoya and Osaka in this game. That would have been interesting. Because then we would have faced the three dragons and Team Darts again. That would be fun. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Dang it. Last member from this team. Sunset Driver. He's gonna ride in the sunset. But yeah, I wish they added more teams in this game. Like, more teams from Nagoya. Like, we got Hot Head, Racing Fun, uh, something other team, uh, um, A Tension, we got, uh, Seeks, we got Generous R. I wish they had, like, Nagoya and, Ko and Osaka in this game. That would have been cool. Uh, gotta fix the camera again, cause reasons. Thank you, game, for being rude. But, like, they should have added more to this game. This game would have been more funner. And add, and add more bosses, too. And we got the leader of Team Speedmasters, which is Iceman. Nice try, buddy. No! Oh my god, if he didn't hit that wall... No, you are not... Pa Dude, come on! I hate this guy! Dude, he's rude! Do not hit that, King! Do not hit that! I see you. Oh, this is really intense right now. Wow, that was easy. We got a boss. A Queen's Knight from the Zodiac. And you know, I wish they put like no loser in this game because those guys were fun they drive what Mishobishis and only Mishobishis and team darts would be fun to face because you know they had a lot of members and they are all customized customized cars I can't wait to play in port tuner challenge or at least give it a try because there's a lot of returning bosses in that game like there's well we have Bloodhound but he's always been in this game and other previous Tokyo Extreme Racer games, but I mean, like, we got the three, uh, dragons, we got the three dragons, uh, Rook, the Bishop, bring it on, buddy, we got Purple Meteor, but they have, like, the Rook, the Bishop, the Knight, you know, those guys as well, but, like, they didn't add that many bosses. I felt like they should. Like, this game, they added a ton of bosses. And the funny thing is, I, um, I just figured out about Tokyo Extreme Racer 3. Is, you know the 13 Devils, how they call them the 13 Devils in this game. They call the 13 Devils in Tokyo Extreme Racer 3 the 13 Ogre Military. Like, um, is that supposed to be a laughable prank or something? Uh, what happened to 13 Devils? Did they all split up or whatever? After White Charisma was somehow humiliated? Like, when you beat him, that's it? I screwed him up. That was a huge one on that one. He definitely just got screwed over right there. I'm like, see ya, buddy. And the final Zodiac member before White Charisma. We got Exotic E from the 12 Zodiac. Yeah, this, the fun fact about this boss. 
So he's not that much of a challenge. Well, not that I know of. She, she's just driving a Supra. Supra. I wish he drove um, a Honda NSX, not Honda NSX, a Subaru. Because a Subaru would make up a huge challenge, and plus would definitely make up a good uh, challenge for the second last Zodiac member. The Subarus are quick, and they're known for their speed. Or at least a Mitsubishi Lancer. You know, why a Toyota Supra, Steel Heart, or Iron Heart, was already a, su a Supra? Or go with the Mach 2 Supra or whatever. You know, could have went for something, like, more difficult. I don't care if I lose to you. But at least I beat two members from the Zodiac. Yeah, we definitely lost. There's no way we're catching her. Oh my gosh, but at least we beat, uh... Queen's Knight and Purple Meteor. Let's see their cars. Oh yeah, I like that nice car right there. Should I buy Purple Meteor? Nah, I'm not going to. No, no car is better than the Speed King. Uh, did we unlock any new parts though? Like any, any new engines? No new engines, huh? Any new parts did we unlock for this car? We had to unlock something. I mean, we faced two bosses in a row. Oh, yeah, we did. More speed. What else did we unlock? We unlocked something. I know we did. At least we unlocked something, which, you know, will make this car much quicker. So I guess we'll go back to, uh... This area. So that's where the uh, exotic Eve is. But I mean, like, I wish. Like. Um. I wish they added more rivals. Like, Tokyo, N Nagoya, Osaka. I'd like to rematch the three uh, dragons. Because that was fun. Even though I lost way more than I won. Like, I lost way more than anything. That is a sand chance against us. We're way too quick for this guy. But I mean, like, why not add more boss? Like, in Tokyo Extreme Racer 3, they added a decent amount of bosses. Like, didn't doesn't Team Darts count like as a, as a boss? I know the leader counts as the final boss of Osaka, but I mean, does the members count as, like, separate bosses? I don't know. Here's the, uh, Exotic Eve. You can stay behind me this time. I see you, because your headlights are pretty bright. No! Definitely restarting. That was a huge screw up right there. Can't, dude, dude, trucks are just mean. Like, okay. What? Why I hate trucks in this game? Because when you hit them, you basically lose. It's basically the end of the game. Okay. We should have enough speed for this guy. I mean, girl. Why am I assuming this person's gender? Yeah. Oh, come on! Dude, these, dude, they put cars in your way for no reason. So, like, you know, I'm just gonna put a random Skyline in King's way, because he was about to catch up to this boss, and the Skyline's like, too bad, buddy, I'm blocking you. Okay, rematch number three. We can beat this one, but just, we gotta not screw up. That's the only thing we shouldn't do. I guess this boss. That includes not hitting a truck. Because trucks get, make you lose so much performance. Okay, good. So far, so good. I think she screwed up this time instead of me. 
I gotta stop hitting the wall, so that's why I'm losing, is because I'm hitting the wall. I gotta slow down. There we go. Oh, final boss right here. White charisma. When 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 uh, Lord Pikachu asked me, what was the hardest bosses? In, I mean, the hardest uh, cars in this game. This is one of them. I'm gonna do a ton of blocking this time. No hitting the walls this time, King. Go this way. <laughs> Wow! Are you joking? This is... Dude! What was that? So, basically, he slams into a truck and loses. Wow. White Charisma effort. Wow. White Charisma. Huge rip in the chat, you guys. White Charisma definitely just got owned right there by the king. That was the best boss fight right there. That was amazing. A legend has become history, but is it true? Aren't there more racers you haven't encountered? Ooh. Leaving a little hint right there. We do have time, so we might face a few wanderers. When all drivers on the highway see your taillights, that's the time you become the real chan champion. Almost said channel. Now, return to the past and turn the legend into myth. That's it? You're not going to leave any hints that there's a secret boss? I'm definitely skipping the credits. No one cares about credits. They're not important. But we beat a white charisma. We schooled him. That's Exotic Eve, and here's White Charisma. So we beat it the game, you guys. Well, actually, not entirely, because... Well, there is a little hint that there is a secret boss, and that is this guy. But, um, I'm probably going to face him off-screen. And the reason for that is, well, I don't know. Now, here's the question of today. What was your guys' favorite boss? We're going to go over them. Trader Jackknife, True Slide... Unhappy Angel, Hard Weapon, Fallen Blade, Bloodhound, Dark Producer, Mr. Sitar, Ironheart, Dying Star, Dreamy Ghost, Tail Gunner, Shadow Eyes, Speed King, and then for the Zodiac, Midnight Rose, Golden Wind, Dark Ringleader, Hard Lift, Blue Pressure, No Crown King, Crying Pluto, Red Devil, Queen's Knight, Purple Meteor, Exotic Eve, and White Charisma. So let me know in the comments, what is your guys' favorite boss? And I guess we'll face some wonders. How many wonders do we have left until the actual, the last, uh, the last rival? Uh, we got 13 more wanders. Which ones can we do? So I'm going to face most of them off screen, though. Uh, Glamour Girl we could do. Can't do that guy. Can't, I don't know if I can run into him. Zero, what day is it? I think you appear on 365. Speedbox we can do. Mask I don't know. Oh, there is a wonder that... How much money do we have? Wait, what day is it today? 350. Yeah, we can't face zero yet. So I guess we'll go fight a... Uh, exotic... Exotic butterfly, I guess. I mean... We're almost done this episode, so... Really. Might as well fight at least some wonders. You know, get some done. I don't know if Exotic Butterfly will show up, but I guess her requirement is only defeating... The only way to beat race her is fight White Charisma, I think? Yep, here's a Wander. Bring it on. Exotic Butterfly. 
guy doesn't stand a chance against us. Goodbye, exotic butterfly. You should have drove a lotus. You would have put way more of a challenge. Okay, he's done. I mean, she's done. Sonic Butterfly is done. Uh, should we face another Wanderer? We'll face a couple more if we can run into any. Uh, that guy we're not going to use. We're probably going to use... You know what? We're going to see if Speedbox will show up. I'll buy a new some new parts for his car. This is uh this is Golden Wind's car. There we go. Make him a little bit quicker. So when we face Speed Box, he's not gonna be difficult. We'll face one more wander, and then we'll end the episode if we can even run into any. If we can even run into him. I know he appears here. Oh, it's gonna be one of these cars, isn't it? When do you appear, White Charisma? I mean, not White Charisma, um. Uh. When do you appear? When do you appear, Speedbox? We'll face one more wander, but I want it to be Speedbox. We got his requirement down. We have the car we need uh we have the car needed to race him. We faced Iron Racer. So basically all we need to do is wait for him to appear, I guess. If he we'll give it two more uh attempts. If he doesn't show up then we'll just call it an episode. Cause today's objective was to finish the uh beat white charisma, but you know what? if he doesn't show up, we'll just end the episode right there. I just wanna see if we'll show up. But thank you guys all for watching this playthrough. I mean, enjoying this playthrough. Not well, watching, enjoying, same thing, whatever. Uh, thank you guys all for enjoying it. I do appreciate it. Um, it makes me, as a content creator, really happy that you guys enjoyed it. And, you know, I'm going to miss playing this game for you guys. I am. Because this was a fun game. I will admit, it was an amazing game to play. But all good things must come to an end. And let's see if he shows up. You know, we'll give it two more tries. Two more tries, you guys. Two more tries. If he doesn't show up, then we'll end the episode. I just want to see if Speedbox actually shows up in this area. Which is kind of strange that he's not showing up. Because we have his, we have the car needed to race him, but he's not showing up. Maybe he shows up only on a specific day or something. I don't know. We'll give it two more tries. Nope. Last try and then we'll... If he doesn't show up, then I guess that'll be an episode. At least we faced Exotic Butterfly. We will run into him off screen. Because, well, we'll race him off screen. Because, well, I'm going to try and 100% this game. And what I might do in the future or something, I might record, make, uh, make a video of all the rivals of Tokyo Extremers 3. And, uh, zero. And it'll basically be me explaining. Yeah, he's not showing up or anything. Actually, should I give it one more try? Yeah, I'm gonna do one more, uh, run. If he doesn't show up, whatever. We'll race him, uh, off screen. I have no issue with that. The wanders we won't be doing is tomorrow, yet again, uh, Gentle Rain, Loyal Knight, and, uh, and Alexander. Something Alexander. We won't be racing those guys. We'll probably race them like later or whatever. Oh, there's a blue arrow. 
This might be the Wander I'm looking for. And hopefully this car does not be very hard to control, because NSX is... This car is not driving that well. <laughs> is this the guy? Wait, who is that guy? Not a guy. Oh, King of Eden. I thought this was Gentle Rain. I'm like, Gentle Rain shows up now? I need, like, 1860 miles on a certain car. Guess I'll race King of Eden. I'm not gonna drive that well in this car, though. I should have used my, uh, Speed King. Oh, yeah, definitely. I'm gonna lose to this guy. I mean, this car does have good speed, but it's very hard to use. I should have used my Speed King. I was trying to draw out speed box. See what I mean? Like, I'm not going to be able to beat this guy. King of Eden. Yeah. I'm just going to end the episode, you guys. I do apologize, but you know what? I can't beat this guy with this car. It's just impossible. I do apologize for that, but... Thank you guys all for coming. Um, uh, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments what was your guys' favorite um, boss. And on that note, I'll see you guys all next time. Have a great day. King signing out.